I'm Larry Anglesano reporting for Aviation Consumer here at Sun and Fun 2015 in Lakeland, Florida. It's hard to believe that Garmin's G500-600 retrofit primary flight display has been out for almost nine years. While Garmin's been making incremental upgrades to the system via software, it's here at the show with a major software upgrade for the system that enhances ADSB weather and traffic information. To tell us more about that upgrade, here's Garmin's Jessica Kass. We're at Sun and Fun 2015, and here at the Garmin booth, we're thrilled to showcase the latest G500 and G600 update, which unveils a number of new features and enhancements to this product that has been out for many years. With the latest software update for the G500 and G600, we've updated the maps to make them much more responsive and much more vibrant. We've leveraged what we, the technology that we incorporated on the GTN and applied that to the G500 and G600. With these updated maps, customers will see that it's much more faster and responsive when zooming in and out on the map. Additionally, on the map, we've incorporated the long-awaited geo-referenced flight charts. So when customers are shooting an instrument approach procedure and they call that instrument approach plate up, they'll notice a magenta aircraft is overlaid on the moving map, enhancing situational awareness. Another long-awaited feature with the G500 and G600 would be the integration with the GDL88 to, to display ADS-B and traffic and weather information. On the dedicated traffic pages of the G500 and G600, the GDL88 will now display ADS-B and traffic information, which also incorporates unique features such as target trend, which allows, which is real-time relative motion technology and displays the trend of the direction of travel of the traffic around you as it relates to your position. ADS-B and traffic information is also displayed on the PFD with synthetic vision enabled. Another unique feature to Garmin and the GDL88 is the display of terminal traffic, which displays ADS-B equipped ground vehicles on the airport surface. Finally, a number of weather enhancements and features have been added to the G500 and G600, including additional weather products with, for customers who already have a GWX70 and Canadian weather for customers who already have GDL69. Another long-awaited feature for customers who have WX500 storm scope is the compatibility to display weather information on the G500 and G600 as well. The G500 and G600 upgrade can be accomplished through a Garmin dealer in the field. Pricing does vary based on configuration. To see all of these enhancements and features and more, visit Garmin and Hangar D at Sun and Fun 2015. Now, for a full report of the enhanced G500-600 PFD, you could read a future issue of Aviation Consumer magazine. Reporting for Aviation Consumer, I'm Larry Anglosano. Thanks for watching.